The Nigerian Defense Headquarters on Thursday says that the Nigerian military in their different operations across the country is currently winning the war against terrorism, insurgency, banditry and other forms of crimes that has bedeviled the nation in the past. Speaking during the weekly briefings in Abuja, Coordinator of Defense Media Operations Major General John Ininchi said, recent reports from different theaters of operations which shows that there is now minimal confrontation from armed terrorists and bandits is an indication that they, the terrorists, have been heavily decimated and can no longer flex muscles in their usual practice. Look at the brief I've been giving you for the past three or four weeks. You discover that direct encounters between us and the terrorists is on the low side. This means that the game is changing rapidly to the favor of the armed forces of Nigeria and Nigerians at large. We keep increasing the tempo and changing our, the, 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 what I call it, style. Let me use a very common language, style of operation, of how to do things here. Whatever we did before is never good for the now. And whatever we are going to do tomorrow, we are on the table planning constantly. While giving updates on other operations across the six geopolitical zones in the country, General Inenche said the Nigerian military recorded a whole lot of successes which led to the rescue of kidnapped victims, neutralization of criminal elements and the prevention of vandalism that would have affected the economic fortunes of the country. Groups of Operation Hadar and Daji and other subsidiary operations have sustained their operations progressively. The gallant troops within the period carried out several operations, including rescue operations, as well as clearance, ambushes, and air patrols. These operations led to the rescue of abducted persons, neutralization of criminal elements, and recovery of arms and ammunition. The troops of the armed forces of Nigeria and other security agencies have not relented in their efforts to decimate the Boko Haram terrorists and ice elements. The military high command also assures the general public of his untiring dedication towards securing the country. Members of the general public are enjoined to continue providing timely information on the activities of criminals in their various localities to the military and other security agencies for prompt and effective action. From Abuja and Festus Ejirogan Fifen for Ben Television.